Anthony, back with the YouTube video. As you can tell by the title, I'm here to give you uh, the current state of Fortnite. Now, um, season six was Fortnite Primal. It started off well. Obviously, it was different compared to other Fortnite seasons. Uh, obviously, being Primal, you know, you had different weapons. Um, the map looked different. It, it went off to a good start. Then, exactly the same as season five. It just didn't end well. It just didn't go well. Simply because they weren't updating the map. There was no story. There wasn't really a story to follow. Uh, it just got boring. Boring and stale very quickly. Like most of the seasons in this chapter. Now, season 7 is now out. It's now been out for over a month. Uh, so basically what the season is, it's basically aliens. So the aliens have invaded Fortnite. If you look right above the sky, there's a big massive mothership. Which is absolutely huge, by the way. By the way, the mothership, I don't know if you've noticed or not. But it's actually moving every day. I'm watching it on Twitter every day. So it's moving location every day. So that's definitely something to keep an eye on. That could lead to an event. Hopefully. <laughs> but right, so Fortnite Season 7. What I think to up to now, it's definitely better than Season 6. Because already, there's actually been a map change already. <laughs> well, I wouldn't say a full map change. But if, uh, if you look at Holly Edges... I forgot the name of the loot. It's called something else now. I think it's Holly, Holly Scratch it or something. I don't even know. But basically now it's got like a big massive like um, gravity zone in it. So if you go in the gravity zone, you like you fly, you can fly, you can go up and down. Basically, it goes slower in it. Now I've just looked on Twitter there. It's actually extended to another house. So it wouldn't surprise me if Holly becomes just like a full place now where gravity is. Now if it's happening to Holly. It's going to probably happen to other locations where they have gravity zones in. It wouldn't surprise me. So that's a good thing. That they're actually changing the map. Um, they're changing, you know, some parts of the map. That's what you want. You want the map to change. You want stuff happening. Because when it just stays stale too much, you get bored of it. You know what I mean? You just get bored. You're just like, oh, you know. It's boring. But, fair place of Fortnite this season. Um, they've also added a mothership, uh, not a mo obviously the mothership was already there, but you can actually go inside the mothership, now I think that's been disabled for now, I'm not too sure, but what you can actually do is, if you look on the map, you see these big massive UFOs, if you go next to them, you have, if you stay on the floor, they suck you in, and they take us to this place where, so you take OG locations, and basically what you have to do is you have to collect these like but, uh, gold balls, so the more gold balls you collect, at the end of you being in the uh, mothership, you get to open... So, say if I collect five of these gold balls, the rarity chests I get to open will be gold. Or epic, or rare. It, 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 it's, it's about how many gold balls you collect. Um, then what you do is, at the end of the round, you open like you get open as many chests as you want. So, that's a good thing they added, of course. Now, we're only one month into the season. There's still another two or three months to go, yes, I think. Two months, sorry. I think the new season's in uh, September. So we've got another month and a half yet to go, yet. Uh, a month, yeah, modest. Yeah, two months. Two months to go. Um, personally, I think they should make the Fortnite seasons uh, two months. Two and a bit month. I think three months a bit too long. But then again, I don't know, you know. It's, um, it, it totally depends what they're going to add in this season. Now, what I want... What I want um, what else to happen this season? I would like to see um, some OG locations return. So, for example, Coral Castle. Why is that even there for? I don't know. So, say if they got rid of Coral Castle, and somehow, like a little event or something, and they had something like um, Junk Junction. Junk Junction is the best place on the map. Best place to land, by the way. No, I'm not I'm only joking. So, say if they had something like... Um, they're not going to put Tilted Towers there. Um, because Tilted Towers belongs in the middle of the map. Like, you know, like, middle to the left. I don't think they'll put Tilted Towers there. Um, maybe they put somewhere... I mean, I don't know. I mean, they put a new location there. They need to get rid of Coral, they need to get rid of Coral Castle. Simple as that. There's no reason for it to be there. So, my guess my guess is going to be is... Um, whenever the next event is, they'll probably get rid of it. I hope so, anyway. But it'll be nice to see some OG, lo OG lo locations return. Um, I would, I would, would do that. I don't know, but it's definitely something to keep an eye on. Um, now this season, this uh, Fortnite season seven. <coughs> um, I think it's probably the best one since season three. 
Now, season three is my best chapter, uh, best season. This chapter, it was where the map was flooded, and every I think one every two one or two weeks the map kept on changing. And that's what I like to watch. That's what if you know me when I play Fortnite, I like things to like to change all the time. Do you know what I mean? And that's what I liked about chapter uh, season three. It was, it was you know the map was changing all the time. People didn't like it. I don't know why. I mean, obviously some people like it, some people won't like it. But this is what season seven reminded me of a little bit. Chapter 3, where the map changes all the time. Stuff changes. So, yeah. I'm enjoying Season 7 up to now. Um, Let's just hope it stays that way. Let's just hope we keep updating the map. And it doesn't just stop there. Because if it does just stop there, it'll just be like the other seasons where it just drags on, drags on, drags on, drags on. And, yeah. Let's just hope they keep changing the map. Hopefully we'll get an event soon as well. Because we need an event badly. A live event. We're now having a live event in two or three seasons, which is not like Fortnite. Because the last chapter, they did a uh, an event every season. So, I'm hoping there's an event this uh, season we'll soon see. So, thank you for watching, guys. If you like the video, please give it a like. If you're new to the channel, please subscribe. Like I said, it's all worth again for me, voice. I'm full of gold. <laughs> Hopefully, it goes soon. Thank you for watching. Take care. Leave a comment below. I am enjoying Fortnite uh, Season 7. Let me know. Take care. See you next video.